Welcome to your weekly reading. This is going to be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of May 20th, 2019. So if it doesn't resonate, uh, don't make it fit. But some of them may or may, may or may not resonate some of the situations and feelings and all that stuff. Hopefully you can gain some insight, clarity into your situations. You can also go back over this during the weekend, recheck it and see how it's fit into your situation so far for the week. So let's get started. Wow, all right. So coming into the week, we have you basically taking some time, observing, maybe assessing the situation, looking at the long-term security, looking at the value of it, um, seeing what the worth and value, how it's, you know, it's a material aspect, how it's going to be secure for you maybe in the long-term future. And uh, you may be pretty defensive about this, feeling like you have to stand your ground. You may have had to, you have may have to stand your ground against other people. And how do you feel about this? We have you feeling like, oh, you want to just bring an ending to this. You want to finally, you know, wrap this all up and get this done with over with because you want to move on and get to probably some better things going on in your life and what has brought what do you think is going to happen <clears throat> you just you're well maybe not think you may feel emotionally exhausted is what i'm going to say and you just want to bring this to an ending you're hoping that this will come to an end in the future you hope is feeling like you're just drained about this there's been a lot of conflict a lot of um backstab and betrayal a lot of ideas being thrown at you and stuff like that so coming into the week what's going on <clears throat> that's just like way too many cards coming into the week regarding the situation what is going on well it looks like you're gonna uh take some time out looking a little bit stubborn there not really there may be an offer someone you're looking at a potential long-term investment here, something for your security that you're coming into. But now here, there's an offer coming to you. And you just don't want to look at it. Uh-uh. It's like, I don't know. You're having to really contemplate about it. Maybe sit and t take some time to really think this out. So it looks like you're, you might be isolating from whoever this person is that's bringing in this cup you know, this option, this new opportunity, you got one in your hand that you're bringing towards into the week, but someone else is offering you something new, something emotionally enticing. <laughs> it's like, well, wait a minute, I got these other three deals going on. These other three offers here, they're uh, pretty good too. I don't know what's in this one. This one's new. It could be also you're dreaming about it, maybe hoping there's an offer. How are you feeling about it though? looks like you're just going to really take some time to look at how is this making you um, feel stable and secure. What's the potential long-term value of it? Again, what has got a lot to do with what your long-term, you know, taking your time looking at things. <laughs> and uh, how is this going? You're looking at wanting to wrap things up. So how long is this going to take? It's, that's what I get a sense of feeling. How long is this going to take this new, you're looking at this plan in your lap, taking your off by yourself in your own little world, in your comfortable little environment or big environment, but you're just wanting to look at this and you're looking at how long is this going to take because you want to wrap this up and this is a new, new possibility here of something secure, stable, but Oh no, you're just really taking, you feel maybe overwhelmed a little, I would think. You plan on maybe taking some swift action though. Looks like there's some swift communication and it's because you just want to forever get this stuff done because you're emotion, you feel that you just want to bring this to an ending. So if you communicate or take fast action, you're hoping to have this come to an end. And so you're going to communicate. You may be communicating something pretty fast. Let's see what kind of action you're taking here. Um, that you just don't want. You want to let go of some burdens here. Let 
you want to just drop some of these burdens. You want to get rid of some of the burdens that you feel overwhelmed and you don't want to feel overwhelmed anymore. So that might be the action you're taking is to let go of some of the burdens that you feel you're having to deal with here. Feeling, because I did say you felt overwhelmed and here's the overwhelmed card, right? <laughs> so in your hopes and expectations for this week, as far as like in the past, what happened? Let's see, there may have been this new opportunity that was presented, this new offer, this new beginning that is long-term security, the offer that you're here looking at now, um, in your present, what is it that you're doing? What are you hoping for right now about this new offer? You're hoping that it'll bring some change. Maybe it'll help you. Maybe you're feeling left out in the cold or having some changes in your security, in your um, material and in your environment. But this is feeling left out in the cold. And so this new offer from the past, maybe that may be something that you're looking at. You're gonna go back to that to go take up this offer. And how do you feel this is gonna affect your future? It'll bring an ending to um, an old way of life. Good, because here's what you're after, right? You're after that ending. You want to, you're trying to really put forward action in order to let go of some stuff. I mean, this is financially draining probably too. You know, just overworked, over, just way overworked. Too many responsibilities and not enough energy to continue on. So you're trying to present fast action. You want fast action. <laughs> as far as your hopes and expectations for something regarding the past we have judgment be made here there's a new awareness be made there's um some past actions could be regarding what made you actually uh come into having changes in your finances and your security here you're making some judgment about the past action here there's a judgment new awareness actually about it and what are you expecting now expecting to just <laughs> take some time out and <laughs> look at it you know it's like oh i'm gonna back off i'm just not gonna communicate i need to really think this through so you're expecting to hopefully get some time away to really evaluate something that you've learned about the past here something about the past especially in regards to this offer what are you hoping to have come forward into the future? Being able to manifest something new, being able to be masterful, learn something new, be able to take control back over, because here this is, you know, you're bringing an ending, you're hoping to have this ending here going into your future, and this is you being able to manifest new things, bring new things into being after, especially having a new awareness about a past situation. So let's see, and it has to do, you know, maybe with this offer, most likely about stuff that you're assessing, you know, taking your time evaluating, da 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 da, long term stuff, that potential goal there. So let's see what's hidden. Oh, there's some people there having a party. They're uh, getting back together. There, there's some friends getting together, um, celebrating, enjoying themselves, and the reason behind that is there's two people who have come into partnership and how does that affect you that may be a judgment that you're making having this new awareness about a relationship from the past that has displaced you and the outcome of this into the future is there's going to be some equal give and take so this is a hidden aspect maybe this is what you're thinking about is a partnership that you may have felt left out in the cold and now there's compromise here. There's um, the ability to be able to have that may be what you're celebrating about something in the past. These three cups down here, because there was this other offer, you're thinking about it. That offer was about a new beginning that's providing long-term security when you really looked at it. That offer's here to help you. And you can manifest from this you can be manifesting, helping other people to being able to, um, this person may be helping you 
or they may be coming to you, these two people may be coming to you and getting help from you because you're the one that has got a mastership here, right? You're able to control, you're able to manipulate things in order to help others. And so you've had to really think about that and this may be a friendship getting back together and have, being happy. A couple getting together and you're helping them out. Okay, so that's how that goes, uh, Aquarius. Let's see what else is going on coming towards the end of the week. Coming in the end of the week. So there's some guidance about the past. In the past, there's been some guidance that was given. And what is about this guidance? It looks like you're going to take action to go offer your help. <laughs> After getting this partnership too, the partnership looks like they're getting some guidance. So if this is actually a, a um, I don't see marriage here. If this is a partnership, you guys are getting a guidance and you're able to extend your help going forward going forward with your a new new offer here something new new hope wow so both of you may actually as if this isn't you this is both of you going and offering help to someone else but we have the chariot as your ending result um going what's happening towards the out what hold on one second <clears throat> being able to go forward it's like these this help here gives, is providing guidance to I would assume because here this help is this is in the unknown though so this is help in the unknown and then there's some guidance being given which is able to have you guys go forward <clears throat> offering a new new opportunity the new potential of love and you guys see this as being able to move forward in what you want to do what you want to go into your future beyond this week at least so wrapping this all up looks like there's going to be some kind of unexpected happenings going on here <laughs> you may find out some unexpected news or something in regards to what you're finding out there's um something there's something that's kind of disruptive there and you were hoping to end things. Let's see what happens. No, it looks like you're actually going to <clears throat> get some, collaborate together with um, some other people, with another group of people. Here's this Hierophant, this person giving guidance. It looks like you guys are going back to this person, visiting them at a later time. Like, um, like I'm, th I'm thinking this could be something that happens at nighttime and so you're having to contact this person because this person, they set rules and regulations, they, they say how things should be and you may be contacting you and the other person may be contacting that person for more guidance to collaborate on an idea regarding this disruption that comes in unexpectedly and how's that going to take you guys, take you into the future you are inspired to continue going forward because you're looking here at what you want to go forward into. It helps you take feel like you have control going forward where how you're wanting to go into next week, whatever it is that you're wanting to do next week. So <clears throat> the all the other thing to look at is that it looks like you're taking control in being able to do bring something to completion too. This is what you're coming into the week wanting to do into the future. And it looks like you have a sense of being able to take control of how you're going to go, what kind of direction you're going to be in charge of, what direction it is to end this situation. And as far as an ending goes, you're wanting to bring something. You're feeling like you just want to bring wrap everything up in here towards the end of the week now because of some unexpected happening you're able to get together with people and start working on completing something, bringing something to an end. <coughs> it looks like you and a partner actually too presently could be um, feeling like experiencing some type of loss in finances or in the home situation and just having to really take a step back and really do some thinking in order to 
get the help that you need to build compromise. Maybe you and a partner need to compromise on something in order to make the changes that are needed. One of you have to make, it could be you having to take action towards a potential, you know, offer of help here, of the help that you need here. So that is your guys' reading, Aquarius. Hope you enjoyed that. I hope that somehow it fits in your life, that it's insightful, clarifying, and helpful in some way, shape, or form. So you can comment, subscribe, like, share. Let me know how it went, and uh, yeah, don't forget to hit the like button, and thanks for watching. Have a great week, and don't forget to check out the dailies just in case your weekly did not resonate with you. All right, ciao.